Hello and welcome to TV. Why I'm Tom Feeney. The Yorkshire Diamonds are getting underway. Their season begins in just a few days' time. Their first match will actually be played on this pitch at Headingley on Saturday. Well, today was their media day, and I've been catching up with Richie Pyra and some of the players. Well, Rich, we're almost there now. The start of the season. How are you feeling? Uh, excited. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Really, we've, we've you know, chatted a lot about. Uh, the build up to it, to, so to finally to get them full time is, is really exciting. We've got a really good uh, team environment already, a lot of the girls know each other, so I think that's key. If, you know, we such a short build up to the tournament, to how well the girls gel together and, and play together is key, so this, you know, this five day build up is going to be uh, very important. And looking at that, the first game, I mean, being held here, it's going to be a great atmosphere, isn't it? And hopefully, lots of people get down to the game. Yeah, I think I think you will. I think we're going to be supported well. The, the Yorkshire public uh, always get behind their team, so expecting uh, quite a few people here, and it'd be great for the girls to play in front of the big crowd and, and to play at home as well. So it's, it's exciting times. And looking at this tournament, just how important is it for women's cricket? It's massive. Uh, obviously, the, the international girls are, are used to, but you've seen this morning how excited the county girls are. They've never had exposure to things like this, so. It's massive for the game if they're going to keep developing uh, good cricketers, international cricketers. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited for the, for the county girls. The captain of the side is Lauren Winfield, who also represents Yorkshire at county level. She starred for England's women's team in the recent victory over Pakistan and now says she can't wait for the T20 format to begin. Oh, I'm hugely excited about leading this group. Um, we've come together today and got all of our fresh kit and a bit of media stuff this morning and then training this afternoon. Um, and there's a real buzz around the group. I think everyone's really excited to, to hit the ground running. Um, and it's really good, you know, to to be playing with some um, some players that you usually play against, both from in county cricket and international level, um, and coming together in this tournament um, is really exciting. I was going to say it must be feeling really real now that you've done the media day today. You know, not that long to go now until it all begins. Yeah, I think you know, obviously the talks of the Super League and then the assignment of the teams and the assignment of the overseas players. I think it's been building up for a while now and spoken about for a while. Um, and it's finally here, so it's you know it's it's very exciting. It's finally come round, and you know just looking to to prepare well over these next few days and hit the ground running on Saturday. Danielle Hazel, like Winfield, tasted success winning the county championship with Yorkshire. The Durham born off spinner is another one of the England internationals the Diamonds have called upon. She says she wants to win the competition. I, mean, I think you know there's no point entering if you're not trying to win it. You know we're we're looking to be the first team to win this, and I think we've got a great opportunity with the squad we've got. Um, hopefully, put on good performances and, and lift that trophy. It's going to be it's going to be fantastic. It's a great opportunity for um, to showcase women's cricket, and I think that. You know, we've got a lot of England players and overseas players involved and I think it's going to be a real good standard of cricket. The Diamond season gets underway on Saturday and they'll be hoping they're in sparkling good form. For TV Yorkshire, this was Tom Feeney.